After you're disturbed! But that's crazy, I know! The title character in Sinbad Legend of the Seven Seas is an actor's dream who wouldn't jump at the opportunity to give voice to one of the most swashbuckling, adventurous characters of all time. Did you catch that last move? Pretty cool, huh? Sinbad, he's a bit of a rogue. Likes a little adventure on the high seas, I'll find a little treasure, fight a few monsters. He likes the girls. Unfortunately for Sinbad, the girls don't always feel the same way about him. <coughs> One of them, who just happens to be an all-powerful goddess, tries her best to make his life miserable. Eris, the goddess of chaos. Yeah, she's, she's trouble, that one. She's hot. She's nice looking, but she's trouble. How dare you? There's a book of peace that's responsible for all the peace in the land. She steals it which disrupts the flow of everything. I think at first Simba doesn't really understand the severe danger that, that Eris poses in the story. Jakob Jensen is the artist responsible for bringing Sinbad to life in the magical world of animation. At first he looks like you know, your typical swashbuckling hero, thief and thug. He has so much history that we get to know more about as we move on into the story. Let's go! I love this film. I'm telling you, this is my kind of film. Seriously, even now as an adult, this is my kind of thing.